All right, so this is our uh, preamble to the ramble. Woo! Ow! Wrapping up our fish week with a little exclamation point. We're going to go to the trout hatchery um, and the, see the sturgeon viewing pond. We are at the Bonneville, fish. the Bonneville Fish Hatchery. Check out some, uh, some monster sturgeon. Can everyone get their mom to sign a field, field trip release? No, I got good at forging her signature a long yeah, time I, ago. The white sturgeon is the largest freshwater fish species in North America. It can reach lengths of almost 20 feet, can weigh up to 1,000 pounds, and they may live well over 100 years. Let's go. Robinson Island. Something you can't high five for sea lion. Oh, we're making a uh, white shrimp chili and two different variations of crab salad. Robinson Island Recreation Center here at the Bonneville Dam. We made the ceviche. Okay. And we are making gumbo. Uh, we're having a team uh, cookout. We are making. Uh, ahi tuna with like a Asian soy sauce and a oyster stew. Well, it's putting an exclamation point on our week of fish and shellfish. Cold oysters and hot oysters. Each team is uh, challenged with a hot and a cold dish for today's taste around. Uh, the cold ones are just with a little bit of hot sauce and lemon and a half shell. And we're going to cook them in the shell and in their in their juices, and then uh, put a little bit of compound butter to melt. So the uh, Sturgeon, which we tasted earlier in the week. What did you guys learn at the Sturgeon Center? <laughs> sturgeon or <are> baby? <laughs> it's got a nice uh, meaty texture and uh, rich uh, flavor. Well, the nice thing about this is we can always edit. Edit. Yeah. Snow crab. Snow crab. Snow what's Cosmo's not All right. <laughs> so, and what are you guys making? Yeah. We, we have got... shrimp skewers. We have a little compound we can, we can butter with up. garlic shallots. Dill. Dill and chives. Right. Dill and chives. Yeah. yeah, we got heat. Cosmo doesn't look too sold on that name. He's not even on our team. No, he's not. <laughs> Do you know how hard it is to control 90 middle school students yeah, without really want fire? I don't want without to. Fire. So we can start cooking, okay. simmering down frog legs. You can get those yeah. broken down. Where there's a will, there's a way. Is it done yet? Seriously? <laughs> Ready? Can you give me any kind of uh, parallel between martial arts and, and cooking? Knife technique is all about muscle memory. A lot, a lot of the techniques in, in uh, cooking are about muscle memory. The hooded Those steamer. Mm -hmm. Team representative over here. Let's describe the dishes. We have ceviche with um, bay scallops and lime juice, um, tomato, green bell pepper, scallions, cilantro, some hot sauce. Um, and then we have gumbo with andouille sausage, shrimp, there's some crab in it, okra. It's a normal potato salad, but it has hot sweet chili. Uh, shrimp skewered over the open flame with the compound butter with garlic and shallots. And, and dill, dill and, and chives. chives. And a tartar with a spicy mustard and jicama. Um, soy sauce, and then over there we have an oyster soup. Goat cheese and spicy tomato chutney, and then down there the oysters uh, raw with a little bit of melted compound butter and some lemon, and then we've got oysters cooking on the grill with compound butter. We have uh, bruschetta, it's goat cheese creme fraiche with prosciutto rolled around dates. We also have a millet salad, and uh, over on the barbecue we have chicken yakitori going. Another day at the office. Oh boy. 
another day at the office.